myself dr nagendra thalor intervention cardiologist today we will discuss about how to manage cholesterol cholesterol is a essential component of uh, cell uh, tissue and blood vessels cholesterol is needed for production of hormone vitamin d bile salt which is used for digestion and absorption of fat body synthesizes 80 to uh, 80% of cholesterol and remaining cholesterol we take from the diet which is called dietary cholesterol so, cholesterol is fatty in nature so it insoluble in uh, blood which is watery in nature so uh, cholesterol is uh, mixed up with protein which is called lipoprotein lipoprotein the inner core is made by uh, lipid and outer part is made by protein so it became the soluble in blood so two type of lipoprotein are important one is ldl which is called low density lipoprotein or bad cholesterol ldl take the cholesterol to the blood vessels and cells and if ldl level is increase in blood it start to accumulate or deposit in inner wall of the blood vessels so blood vessels become thick and hard and they increase the blood pressure and they increase the risk of heart attack and brain stroke other is hdl which is called high density lipoprotein for good cholesterol because it take the cholesterol from the blood and it take to liver where it utilize or is excreted out from the body so h in hdl is stand for healthy one more uh, lipid or fat is present in the blood which is we called triglyceride triglyceride we get from the diet and body also synthesize triglyceride if cholesterol level is high in body usually we have no signs and symptoms and we know it by only by blood test for which we do the lipid profile test in the lipid profile test we measure total cholesterol hdl cholesterol ldl cholesterol triglyceride level and we ldl and we measure in the milligram per deciliter so desirable range of total cholesterol should be less than 200 and ldl less than 100 hdl more than 60 and triglyceride less than 150 mg per deciliter if this uh, cholesterol level is increase above the normal limit it uh, start to accumulate in the blood vessels and is increase the risk of heart attack and brain stroke so we need to keep it at low level and if our cholesterol is high we should take the measures to decrease it in normal range for this we uh, can take some medicines or diet modification and lifestyle changes in the medicines we use uh, statins which is most common medicine used in day by day and they decrease the ldl cholesterol and increase hdl cholesterol other are uh, uh, bile acid sequestrants which also decrease the ldl and uh, nicotinic acids which increase hdl and decrease the ldl other are fibric acid derivatives which are mainly used for to reduce decrease the triglyceride level but they also reduce the ldl and next is cholesterol absorption inhibitors they also reduce the ldl level so all these drugs we can use single or in combinations besides drug we use some lifestyle changes uh, like we should take healthy eating habits in which uh, the saturated fat we should be take very less and saturated fat like uh, fatty meat cheese and dairy product processed food they should be keep minimum and diet high in the saturated fat trans fat salt or sugar should be keep minimum and diet rich in fiber or fruits or vegetables we should increase fiber rich diet like oat meals whole grain nuts and beans we should take and next is exercise if you do daily exercise for 30 minute moderate intensity exercise or 150 minute in week this exercise increase our hdl level reduce ldl level and triglyceride and next is weight reduction if our body weight is uh, more than our uh, height so we reduce the body weight and if we reduce by 10% it definitely uh, reduce our 
कोलेस्ट्रॉल एंड ट्राइग्लिसराइड लेवल नेक्स्ट इज क्यूट स्मोकिंग और अल्कोहल बिकॉज बोथ डिक्रीज द एच डी ए लेवल एंड इंक्रीज द रिस्क ऑफ हार्ट अटैक एंड ब्रेन स्ट्रोक एंड नेक्स्ट वी शुड रिड्यूज आवर स्ट्रेस लेवल बिकॉज स्ट्रेस ऑल्सो रिड्यूज एच डी एल एंड इंक्रीज एल डी एल सो वी शुड रिड्यूज आवर स्ट्रेस लेवल बाई योगा मेडिटेशन एंड टेक द प्रोपर स्लीप ऑफ सेवन टू नाइन आवर्स विच हिल्स एंड रिपेट्स आवर हार्ट एंड ब्लड वेसल्स इन द लास्ट समराइज द टॉक the cholesterol is a essential component of body tissue and cells and it is one of the major controllable risk factor for heart disease heart attack and brain stroke so if our cholesterol is high we should take proper medicines and dietary modification and lifestyle modification and what our age every day we should follow steps to keep the cholesterol Uh, lower and we should take uh, time to time uh, doctor advice and regularly check our cholesterol level so you can uh, keep and follow up it thanks to all for watching